My friend, as I come to you in prayer for the new year, we have to acknowledge that this last year has been unlike any year that either of us have ever lived in. It's been a very difficult year, a difficult year with the virus, a difficult year knowing people that have gotten sick and maybe you have been sick yourself. But now we're approaching a new year and there has never been a time where New Year's Eve and New Year would bring in a new era. We always pray for a new life in the new year. Well, we're going to have it. And it is because of the miracles of God, the vaccines coming that are on the trucks right now, and the absolute purity and immunity of society that will take place in 2021. In other words, we'll get back to life again. I ask you to join me in prayer. Dear God, I ask that I am healed over what I have been through in 2020. I pray that it will not take on any residual effect in me, that I will know that I am going towards the light at the end of the tunnel and that there is good being prepared for me and mine. I pray that this is a time that I will know health, that I will know absolute purity wherever I go in the air and around me, that I will feel safe, and I pray that you'll make it so. I pray that you will affect all of society by wiping out this virus once and for all, in our country and every country, in every space, without one person being left. We pray for empty ICU rooms, we pray that the doctors and the nurses can have a new sense of uh, relief, that they can take vacations, that they can be honored for who they are and what they did and what they continue to do. I pray that God will bless them directly in ways that they can't even imagine. I pray, and you pray, that God blesses every one of us with a sense of hope, a sense of new life, a sense that we can have the greatest success ever in our whole lives, that the whole economy is like a repressed spring getting ready to bounce back. And we will bounce back with your direction, God, we will bounce back with greater pay. We will bounce back with greater reward. We will bounce back with greater investments. You're going to make all things happen. You're going to make all things better. You're going to completely heal all of society and to take away our pain and to take away the memory of pain. We pray for this new God-given year, this God-given time, this God-given health, and we pray that we can each be a part of it. We pray that the people that have been affected in the economy, in their work, that they are blessed, that they return not to the same jobs necessarily, but better jobs that there is a real demand for who they are and what they can offer. I pray that each one of us will be given new talents through our mind, through connection with you. New ability, new energy, new hope that is not anchored in any way to past and to pain. I pray that we're anchored to the future that we're anchored to something higher than ourselves, that we have an ability within us that we can't even understand right now. We will only know for sure when we're looking back a year from today and say, 
wow, God, what you did for me. So, God, I ask you to bless my own personal path in 2021. I ask you to bless it with success. I ask you, God, to bless my path with health. I ask you to bless my path with immunity. And I pray that in every way that I am a healthy, safe, safe individual that is protected and can go anywhere, be with anyone, and that we can come together again and honor that coming together as never before, realizing the value of our closeness. God, I pray that you will bless each individual person that is praying with me now in ways that she or he doesn't even understand. I pray that this will be a special time going into a special year, going into a new era of our lives. In Jesus Christ's name, we so pray. Amen.